Everybody's sleeping. I want to get into some stuff. <laughs> Remember when I talked about this? This is the door monkey that I talked about videos ago, probably a couple months ago, um, for a solution for Braley uh, waking up in the middle of the night while me and Stacy were sleeping. I want to give you guys an update on that. Um, I know I've been asked a few times in the comments of how it's going. And so I will say that this really didn't last long. It worked for one night. We don't know for sure how she got out. It was up, up top like this. Her getting through at one time is too many times just because all it takes is one time for something bad to happen. So uh, Stacy was on her way waking up at five, four or five in the morning when this happened. She noticed that Braley was out of the room. She had left the room and it's possible that Stacy woke up because of the noise from her. Maybe she rattled the door back and forth. That might have woken woke Stacy up or Braley just might have like reached it. So we started looking for a new solution. We've been doing some research, trying to find something to keep her safe at night. If you didn't watch the wi our video about the door monkey, Braley has, if she gets out of this room while me and Stacy are still sleeping, there's just way too many dangerous situations that she can get herself into. Her biggest danger is this ledge. We could alter it, like put a, something there on top of it, but we're planning on moving sooner than later. We're not looking to uh, do any major modifications to the house. There's a lot of stuff that she can get, dangerous situations she can get herself into in the house because she does not understand safety precautions. What did we find? What was the solution? So very excited to show you this next product. I know the last one I was excited about, it just didn't work out for us. I mean, it may work out for some people, it just didn't work out for us. Care Caregiver Alert Monitor. This thing is pretty cool. This is the motion sensor part of the device. It's a very sensitive motion sensor. It will go off with any type of movement. Um, they're, they're, I have them both, by, they are both battery operated. They can also be plugged into walls. So before we go to bed, I put, a, I put down the motion sensor and I turn this thing on, a chime notch thing, switch lever, and it's got the three different, uh, it's got three different volumes on it. I personally put it on medium. Low battery indicator, that is extremely helpful. You never know when a battery's gonna die and you don't want it to happen. It does an alarm or something. Here we go, have it turned on. I'm gonna be Braley real quick, okay? I'm sleeping. Oh, what is this? Ouch. I'm just sleeping and I wake up, Braley waking up. I'm like, I wanna get into some stuff. That's what I imagine her thinking. Everybody's sleeping, I wanna get into some stuff. <laughs> and look at that. It's pretty loud and this is not even on high. We've tested it out a few times and we've actually uh, had a couple nights where Braley did wake up while we were sleeping and this woke us up almost instantly. Like this thing, the alarm is perfect. It's like an alarm clock and we know the tone. Our unconscious brains are like, oh, Braley's awake. That's exactly what we're looking for. We need to make sure that we don't sleep through her waking up in the middle of the night. This thing has a really good uh, field of view, the motion sensor on here. I feel like this is probably the most comfortable I've slept without worrying about Braley waking up with us being asleep, definitely. We did get suggestions about alarms, like a door, like a door chime alarm thing. What's nice about this one is that it's gonna wake us, like it's in the room with us and not over here. Um, so it'll be, it's just, it's just more beneficial to be able to have this on us, the alarm on us and it's not blaring and braille at Braley. 
the noise can be very alarming and uh, Braley is sensitive to sound and it could cause anxiety going through doors for her. Like she could be worried that alarm is going off when going through any door at any time. And so I think this is perfect because it's us hearing an alarm. She doesn't need to hear the alarm when it goes off. So this is us hearing an alarm. It wakes us up every time and it's perfect. It is absolutely an awesome device that for us. It works for us. I don't know if it'll work for anybody else or not. It's an improvement from the door monkey, which is now only going to be used for air circulation, especially in the winter because some rooms get really hot and some rooms get really cold. This would even be perfect for traveling. Say we're at an Airbnb that's like a normal house. This We could put this by a front door or a door. Maybe there's two doors and we have two of these devices. I don't know. I'm just very, very happy that we finally found something that works for us. Um, <laughs> knock on wood. Knock we on say wood. That every time and I'm, then I'm pretty sure. The I'm pretty sure I said the same thing about the door monkey. I don't know how she can beat this one, like unless she's a ninja. Like maze. I just think of those <laughs> laser things from like spy movies. They're like duh, 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 yeah. duh, duh. What is it, Mission Impossible? Mission Impossible. Where they do that, where they're like drop down through the lasers. I, <laughs> I wouldn't put it past her. <laughs> oh boy. I'm hoping that the door monkey did at least help one somebody out there, that maybe it's useful for somebody out there. For us, um, this is definitely going to be a lot more effective. Thank you everybody for those uh, recommendations from our original monkey, door monkey video. It gave us st stuff to think about and gave us ideas for what would ultimately work for Braley and we were able to find. That is it for today. Thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Have a wonderful day. This is the monkey something. The door monkey. That's right. I got myself a haircut. Stacy made me though. I did not make you. <laughs> I just told you you can't buzz it. I'm just kidding. It was a joke. It was a, a sarcastic joke. You like your cottage cheese? <coughs> hey. How are you liking your cottage awesome. cheese? <coughs> Temperature regulation in Minnesota between bedrooms is really hard to do. This is peace of mind. That's what this is. Better sleep. Did she really go num num num? Yeah, audibly saying how good it is when she eats it. That's it. That's all I got for it's all I got for the day. Really got anything? You got anything to say before you go? Hey. Do you got anything to say before you go? Cottage cheese? Cottage cheese. Yep, cottage cheese. Carlos was saying, I'll take some of that cottage cheese. You're on a diet, sir. Treat me, I'd always get right back